Well, good morning. Good morning. We're off to Orlando today, aren't we? We are. Really, really excited because this time... We're travelling with family and the grandchildren. Yes, we are. They're not going to be on the blogs because they don't like being on it. To be their truthful, we're a little bit of an embarrassment. So, mate, we rest doing this YouTube thing. They seem to be. They, don't. they can't say. <laughs> They're getting around it. They're getting around it. But anyway. So, anyway, I will stop babbling on. Onward with the journey. Come along and see what we get up to. So we stayed in the Premier Inn South Hotel, which is about five minutes drive to the Long Stay car park. We have actually done vlogs on this hotel before, so we didn't do them again today. But onward with our journey, as Carol's has left me. How long did it take us to get here from Premier Inn South, Gatwick South, to Long Stay car park? Um, roughly 10 minutes. 10 minutes, yeah, yeah. which ain't too bad. So it's half term. We've I mean, never experienced this before, have we? No, it's absolutely It is heavy. manic here, absolutely manic. If you can have a look. And over here is the self-check-in desk, which is probably a lot longer than the actual where they check you in. So about half hour, an hour to check in. Later. But we are here three hours early, yeah. so it's not too bad. 25 minutes so far and we're only halfway towards the actual bag drop. This is mega queues. So to check our bags in took 40 minutes, 40 minutes and now we're on the way to departures. Well, security, <laughs> security. <laughs> I reckon this is going to be a long while. We've yeah. got an hour, no, we've got two hours she left to our flight. To security yeah, so off we go. So anyone that's actually followed our channel knows that we go away quite a lot. But Carol decided to pack some cream body lotion into her bag, so she got stopped. So we've got a five minute delay while they ch check it. So when you come to the airport, all liquids out of bags, please. And there she is, waiting to be searched. So you were a silly billy, wasn't you? Do you know Putting why? cream. Oh, do you know what? I've not used this case for a long time and it did the patch bit. So. There's the excuse. She hasn't used that case. Not, not How many airports have we been to this yeah, year? Yeah, but I didn't take this for the last time, couple of trips. Always an excuse. Let's go onward. Through duty free, onward to the plane. You just want me to get caught just so I didn't have enough time to get through duty free. <laughs> For once, I ain't got to worry about this because my wife is waiting for our grandchildren and children. So where is the lift? They come down the lift, didn't they? Around the corner, yeah? So if you take the lift stand instead of the escalators, you miss out all the duty free. Brilliant. And I didn't know this for so long. So long. Carol, it's great, ain't it, eh? We're whizzing through duty free. Well, I know not to take the lift next time. <laughs> <laughs> so we're actually through duty free now and into the departures all. Lovely. Now all we've got to do is meet up with the family and then decide on what we're going to do. I've done it on my other vlog, so I'm going to do it on this one. When you come through departures all, it's like a horseshoe shape. And there's a first floor and there's a ground floor. The first floor is where the kids area is and there's a big board over there. Loads of shops, what you get in every single duty free in the world and shop and airport. WH Smiths and whatever. So should we catch up with the family now, yeah? Yeah, I don't know where she is. Should we try and bring her or should we just try no, and find her? No, we just wander her? around, we'll find her. So this is one of us most stressful being at the airport time, isn't it? Because we're travelling with family. We just have no time to do anything at all. We've had no time to do duty free. We haven't got no time to actually get anything to eat. Our actual airplane's going to be called the gate number in about five minutes. We've been here two hours already. Yeah, but it's yeah. so busy, isn't it? Very stressful, but no duty free, no spending. Very cheap way. If you take the lifts from 
the actual security and, and they literally miss all the duty free and just come straight through the departure stand. Which Carol loves, don't you? We're going to take that all the time now, aren't we? No, I'm not, you can. Yeah. But no shopping today, girl? As it is. Oh? As it is. As it is. As it is. So we're off to gate 25 with loads and loads of other people. And then hopefully we can calm down and take it easy. Because so far it's been rush, rush, rush. Carol, are you looking forward to this holiday? Yes, I am. Yeah, it's been, it's been a bit stressful, isn't it? Not stressful, it's just been very, very busy. Very busy. We're never, because we always come out of season, during the school holidays, it's another world, another world. So onward to the gate. Why did you walk? Why did you walk on there for? I'm just standing here, taking it easy. Oh, maybe it is quicker. Carol was right. Try to catch up with her. Carol, babe, wait for me. Bye bye. This ain't our one, is it? No, <laughs> I thought it was then. Right, so 25, onward we go. Because, because we didn't have no time to get any meals, breakfast, and nothing, you got an actual meal deal in boots, didn't you? Yep, and it so, was five pounds. Oh no, five pounds each meal, basically. Ten pounds. Ten pounds. Ten pounds. Which is a lot better than going in the restaurants anyway, isn't it? You probably got in the restaurants. Yeah. But it's, it's so busy. Yeah, it's so busy, but it's nice because we ain't got no waiting around the airport at all. Everything's really good. Yeah, we come straight through to the gate. Well, we've still got a bit of waiting, but I don't have to be bored just so. Yeah, and it's definitely a full flight because you can actually tell that it is chock a block here, chock a block. Everybody wants to go to Orlando, and why not? Just Looking to forward to now. it? Yeah, I just want to get on that plane and shoot off. So it's our time to board now? Yes. Yeah, the airplane is just around this corner. Let's get on there and let's board. Keep going, Cal, keep going. She's so excited to get on. So excited. This is the old Carol back now. And the first look at our airplane. It's taken us to Orlando. Right at the back of the plane as normal, uh, two seats together. Going past the premium lounge. Into the first economy section. Now we're into the second economy section. And if you haven't seen our other vlogs before, we always pick the back seats because the actual airplane narrows and you get two seats by the window. So we don't have to sit with anybody. We don't want to inconvenience no one. And there we are, number 44. And this is our seats. And as you can see, pretty lot of leg room. And you can decline the chairs without interrupting anybody else. So as soon as we sit down, Carol is on her phone answering messages on YouTube. Ain't you, Carol? I haven't had time, have I? You haven't had time at all, no. Time. You've been... So if I do miss anyone out, I apologise. I will get back to them when I get Yeah. Over. Well, this won't go on for about two days, so they'll probably be answered by then. But this is how committed Carol is. You love it, don't you? I do. And we're being pushed back and soon be on our way.
so the entertainment on board is really good, isn't it, on British yeah. Airways? It's yeah. really, really good. You've got loads and loads of people. We ain't going to go through them all because we've done it on our other flights. It hasn't changed, but there is so much. Do you know what you're going to watch yet? I'm going to watch. Yeah. I'm going to go and watch Distribution. Distribution? Distribution. I don't I'm know what that there. one is. The one with Liam Nielsen. Oh, right. Something like that, I think it is. Was it Retribution? Oh, Retribution, that's the one. I don't know what it was, but anyway, that's when you're going to watch. Yeah. Okay. But, as we said, there is loads and loads and loads of films. So we always bring our own headphones, don't we, Carol? Yeah. Because they're just a little bit more comfortable than the ones that BA actually supply, ain't they? Yeah, but I got mine last time and they weren't too bad. Yeah. No, they, no, they do give you like little ear plugs, don't they? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But these ones just a little bit more comfortable. Yeah. Just a little bit. Yeah. yeah. But sometimes these get a bit around my ears. The earbuds. Oh. It's easier. Oh, in that case. <laughs> Can't please some people, can you? <laughs> so the old ones. You, would your mum? I know. No, I'm not going to wear pink. I'm not going to wear pink. Come on. No. So you get your little pretzels as well, don't you? I do. Pretzels. Favourites. Your favourite. And I went for a wine. And so far, just a normal flight. Nothing dramatic, which is what we want, isn't it? Yes, yeah, definitely. Don't know drama. No drama, don't no no drama. drama at no. all, no. And um, yeah. so we just carry on, have these. Watch the films. And relax. There is one problem. I shall go for my big problem. The actual USB port, which you get on your TV screens, both of them, mine and Carol's, are not working, so they're not charging any of the phones or the cameras, are they? And the other thing is, when we was um, taking off, they said about the Wi-Fi, but they did actually tell us it's probably best not to actually get the Wi-Fi because they get they actually get the wi-fi signal from land so when you go overseas they can't get it so it was nice that they told us that so i'm not buying the wi-fi this trip and i'm just going to sit here watching the films and the entertainment and trying to enjoy myself as much as i can and so are you cow ain't you i am but i can't get into my gin you can't get into your gin oh my god the, f the first major problem oh boy a problem <laughs> one and a half hours into the flight and meals have turned up. I went for the cottage pie. You also get some cheeses. Jacob's cracker, which I love. A water. That stuff there, I've never ever liked. And also a chocolate raspberry mousse. What did you go for? Vegetable curry. The vegetable curry, yeah? Yep. So it's the same as my bedroom. Your one smells lovely, doesn't it? It does smell quite nice, actually. It does smell very, very nice. Very, very nice indeed. Enjoy it. It's really nice, actually. Yeah. It's I had nice. a little taste of your one, and it was... Yeah, I think I had it last time I was on here, and it, it's a nice Thai curry flavour, isn't it? Yeah. And my one... It's, uh, yeah, it's pretty tasty indeed. I'd give it a 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10, yeah? yeah. I think you know popper doms with it, otherwise it would have been a 10. <laughs> no, no popper doms. But that was pretty nice, wasn't it? It was Your nice. One. Always a firm favourite, <laughs> the chocolate mousse. It's a chocolate mousse, isn't it? It's chocolate mousse with raspberry. And it is lovely, isn't it? I gave mine to Alex, I don't like raspberry. You don't like raspberry? I was in a grumpy mood I'm today. In a grumpy mood. Very grumpy mood. I'm in a grumpy mood. Stephen is in his happy mood. Yeah, 
happy mood. Because <laughs> we didn't do no duty free shopping. Did we? No duty free shopping I at all. We didn't want anything. We never got anything. We're, didn't anything. We're both happy. We're both happy then. I was spending one amount here. <laughs> so our plates have taken away very quickly once we've had the meal. They've come round and asked us tea or coffee. I went for a coffee. Carol went for a coffee as well, didn't you? I did. Yeah. But they're looking after us quite well, ain't they? I did laugh though. What did you laugh? Well, I she said to me tea or coffee. I said coffee. Yeah. And then you turned around and said, "Have you got a coffee for me, please?" <laughs> did I? <laughs> I didn't want to be left. I oh, wanted to turn around and say, "No, not for you." <laughs> <laughs> but no, they are really looking after us. So we always find that British Airways staff are really friendly yeah. and do look after you really well, don't they? Yeah. I've said that on other right, blogs. Um, so it's true. I don't know if they're told to be like that or if they're just really happy people. But they are very, very nice. And as you see down there, they're all working really, really hard. They come along all the time. They come around with drinks. Really, really nice people. Thank you, British Airways staff. Okay, Carol. Carol. <laughs> see, this is a problem being on an aeroplane with your grandchildren. Carol totally ignores me. Sorry. We're going to do what we thought of the food. Overall, I'd give that an 8. I wouldn't give it a 10 if they didn't have that silly rice thing. I wish they would just have a salad with a little bit of olive oil on it. Make the meal lovely. But you got 8 out of 10. What did you get? I'd give it a 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10, yeah? Because yeah. you like that silly little thing, don't you? I do. Like a rice nut thing. I don't like, yeah, but then I didn't like the chocolate mousse. No, you didn't. And you so, didn't get no butter. I, oh, no, that was other I thing. gave you my butter. Yeah, seven and a half out of ten now. I only, we only got one butter. I didn't get a butter. That's the second time, I think, on British Airways I haven't got a butter. Yes, as I'm getting older and older, I'm getting grumpier and grumpier. They're not trying it to happens, butter you up, are they? It happened to you. Me up. <laughs> no, they're not trying to batter me up at all. Okay, so now Carol is disembarking to the other seat over there. I'm going to have my granddaughter sitting next to me or looking out the window. Excuse me. And then I might be able to watch a film later on. But we're enjoying the flight, and even my daughter, who won't actually say on camera, said she can't believe that two hours have gone so quick. So it's not just us, other people like it as well. Didn't she say that? She did say that. Yeah, she said that. Anyway, on we got a flight. Where would we be without TVs on a long, long haul flight? Every single person watching TV. Carol, can you go get me a biscuit? No. no. Why not? Because you've got legs. Well, and then you've got to get up, I've got to get up. Quite happy to get up. Okay, go on, off you go. I'm gonna get a biscuit. Where are the biscuits? You sure you can get them? You're lying to me. Everyone's been doing. I'm eating them. You sure? Promise you. Positive, yes. Yeah. All oh, right, so you can just help yourself with any food that you want here. Brilliant. up there there was a woman and no that's mine there was a woman up there and she just went and got another dinner you can just help yourself and they, they literally will help you with anything you want you can have a dinner they have to help me up don't they they went up there and she just got it oh, right, okay. yeah it's brilliant they got up there okay. and also i went and got these lovely do you want me to go with you no it's behind this wall we are yeah, Not in the thingy behind the wall. Go along there, be literally behind this wall just here. Right, it's just a thingy. Go in there, you'll see them. Tons of them. Sadie, can you show Mum? She's been up there twice. So Carol's been up there to go and get her drinks and all the, um, the peanuts and she can't find them, so my daughter's going up there with them. Hopefully, she'll be back in a minute. Did you find them? 
Not and, peanuts, and, eh? Not peanuts. What did you get? Got you then. You got me then. Is that what I had a minute ago? Yes. And what else did you get? A chocolate bar. Never knew that. All the times we've actually flown on this plane, we've never known that you can just go and help yourself with snacks. She knows you can get them. What? I think the children found it. Yeah. It's good, ain't it, Carol? Are you? Really good. And these seats being right at the back. You can recline them and also you can just go up and get yourself anything where you want and the drinks and all that. Really, really enjoy your British Airways. You're enjoying this flight so far, yeah? Yeah, it's nice. It's a good day to do. Was it the chicken one you went for? Sweet pepper chicken. Sorry, the sweet pepper chicken. Sweet sour and chicken. And what is it like? It's quite very nice. Is it nice, yeah? Yeah. Oh, I don't know what you said, but it was sweet pepper chicken I went for. Sweet, sorry, what was it again? Sweet pepper. Sweet pepper chicken. Yes. And it's very nice. Yes. Yeah? Yeah. I'm not even at my one yet. But this is nice. Only one hour left to go now. The one hour and five minutes. Hey, not bad at all, is it? And it's not been that bad a flight, is it? Yeah. We've been entertained with the grandchildren a lot, ain't we? Yeah. To be very truthful. And um, also playing Angry Birds. <laughs> the clouds are clearing up. And hopefully we'll be there pretty soon. Started our descent into Orlando. happy? No, we've landed. You're very happy, ain't you? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Sadie, happy? <laughs> yeah, even my daughter got a nod. <laughs> very excited. Not for 35 degrees. <laughs> 35, they just said it's 35 degrees there. And everybody has actually just got up to get out and we're going to be at least five minutes, ain't we? I'll tell you, at least 10 minutes even. 10 minutes, bro. But it's just nice to stand up. It is. But everyone's <coughs> really happy. <laughs> ain't they? And we can hear the children. Orlando flights are always happy, aren't they? Yeah, they are, yeah. yeah. Just realise how big this plane is when you're walking down here, don't you? We was only here in February, wasn't we? Yeah. Actually getting on the plane. Now we know we've got that long walk, don't we? We do. Off we go, go, off we go. And it is a very long walk. If it's the same walk we did last time, it is a probably a 10 minute walk to immigration. And the last look at our plane. It is massive. Okay, keep going, Carol. Eight minutes. Walk. and it is all the way to the bottom down now but we're in Orlando and we're happy so when you come into Terminal C you actually pick up your cases before you go through passport control so immigration took us 15 20 minutes not even, I would say no. not, not even that not even that I can't hear you sort of, but yeah, so not even that, was it? No, no, no. really quick actually, I thought it was going to be a lot longer because all the, our visit was. Our visit was, yeah. 
But now we've got our victory. We've just come for a beer, we're just waiting for the rest of the family to join us. Hopefully they'll join us in a minute. And then we've got to go straight over here and down the stairs to pick up our car. And also we've got to pick up a um, child seat as well this time, which we've never done. We've got to pay that locally. So I'll let you know what that comes to when it's done. Migration took us 15, 20 minutes. Not even, I would say no. not even that. Really. Not even that. I can't hear you sort of, but yeah, so not even that, was it? No, no, no. really quick actually. I thought it was going to be a lot longer because all the, how busy it was. How busy it was, yeah. But now we've got our victory. We've just come for a beer, we're just waiting for the rest of the family to join us. Hopefully they'll join us in a minute. And then we've got to go straight over here and down the stairs to pick up our car. And also we've got to pick up a um, child seat as well this time, which we've never done. We've got to pay that locally. So I'll let you know what that comes to when it's done. Yeah, we've just come through. We went down one level. We jumped over to the Alamo car rental place. So now we're giving the paperwork. You've got to tell them about the car seat car as well. Car seat, yes. Yeah. And then pick up the car. And um, we should be on our way. And on our way. Hopefully. Straightforward as that. Then we get lost on the way to International Drive. So that went pretty Excellent. well, didn't smoothly, it, eh? Yeah. Everything's really smoothly. Yes. Took us about 15 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. So now downstairs, pick and up the car. I'll, I'll take note that we got a, ordered a car seat and um, she said we could have it for nothing. We didn't have to pay for it. I don't know if we have got it for nothing. We'll find out when we get downstairs. Okay, well that's what they yeah, said. I don't think we have. Okay. Oh, okay. But anyway, let's go downstairs now because I want to go back and get to the airport. Get to the airport. Get to the airport. Go get to the, I'm going to the hotel. <laughs> get to the hotel. <laughs> Let's go. Bye. Got to the minivan. We're going to pick this one in. Literally the white first white one we come in. First thing you should always do is just to film all around the car. Got any scratches, any marks, anything like that at all. Just for peace of mind and help you out. Also look at the tyres as well. We had it once before where that's, we had a flat tyre and it caused us nothing but grief. So, just quickly looking around this car. It's got a few little scratches on it, not too bad. Looking on the roof as well. This is just for my own peace of mind. But no, pretty big car. It's gonna take the whole lot of us. A few little dents and marks on the actual bumper, but nothing special. So now, let's put our bags in here and let's go. The car seat we just pick up just before we actually got to the car and um, Alamo give us it free of charge, didn't they? Yeah, Carol was right. So we're on our way, yeah, Carol? We sure are. Should be there in 12 minutes. 12 minutes. And we've got 11 minutes till we get to International Drive. Are you excited, Carol? Very excited. I'm just concentrating on my camera and the road. So we made it on to International Drive. We dropped off the family. The family at their hotel. The staff flyer there, which we're going to go on probably tomorrow, I reckon, Cal. Yes. As we said, we've got two cars of subscribers, we'll go on it, we're not looking forward to it at all. No, we're going to get it over and done with, so we can enjoy <laughs> the holiday. <laughs> so it's good to be back on International Drive, isn't it? It sure is, we like we've been away. Yeah, we literally just went into the um, hotel room, put our cases in there, and then changed our clothes, didn't we? Yeah, freshened up. And freshened up, and then we are literally just going out. We're going to go to, where are we going, Carol? We're going to Checkers. We're going to Checkers. It's our traditional. Well, say traditional, we've done it once before. So oh, twice before. Was it twice? Yeah. What, on the first date? Yeah. You sure? Sure it was. Oh, well. I think it was only once, but never mind. Either way, we're going to Checkers, which is a port of call when we first get into Orlando, or nowadays it is. And we're just wandering down, having a look at um, International Drive again for the first time and trying to stay awake as late as possible and try to get onto this time. Yeah, at the moment actually, I don't feel too bad. You don't feel too bad yeah, at the moment, no? I don't no, feel too bad, but then again, it's like, it's very bright, it's very, very warm over here, isn't mm. it? Yeah. Right, it's very, yeah. very warm over here. 
probably the warmest I think we've one of the warmest we've ever had. 35 I think you said it was when we landed. When we landed, yeah. Yeah, it yeah, uh, has been. Yeah. But anyway, hot, we're right? waffling on. Mm -hmm. So we will just wander along. Checkers and then onwards somewhere else. May it, meet up with some family. May meet up with family. We don't know exactly what we're Depends doing. Depends on how tired we are. Yeah. At the moment we feel okay. Yeah. But, we but we're, we're literally just wander down here and see how it goes on. And see how this travel day ends. But so far, super excited to be here. Absolutely super excited. It's raining, hasn't it? Brilliant. What? And it's like we've never been away. Isn't it? Well, can't you smell the yeah. helicopter fumes? Oh, you can smell the helicopter fumes, oh, yeah. Oh, it smells like the old ice cream van. Yeah, it does, it yeah. Does. Yeah, it does, yeah. And one thing we forgot to mention is, as we're checking in, someone come up to us, shook our hand and said, thank you for doing the... Vlogs, didn't yeah. they? Well, thank you, Dean. No, so it was Dean, yeah. So thank you very much for coming over and saying hello. We appreciate you a lot. So we were just saying that we've got recognised as we come in the hotel. We're walking down International Drive and two people or followers to our channel stopped us and said hello. You are Alan. Alan. I'm Carol. Jenny. <laughs> and Jenny. I know you're Carol, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and they, yeah and I don't follow you. No. <laughs> no, it is. It is lovely to meet people, isn't it, who yeah. follow along yeah, with us, nice, it really yeah. is. And, the, and they and live quite close to us, yeah, they live in Kent the same as us. Yeah, so thank you very much for saying hello, we nice really appreciate it. We really, really do appreciate it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why you look forward to seeing us, you know. <laughs> yeah. It's so interesting. Oh, thank you. They thank you. Really. They laugh at us, really. Yeah. With you. <laughs> All right. Oh, well, thank you very much. Anyway. We just did. Carol. What? How inviting does the Armour Breeze look right now? It looks so lovely, don't it? I'm definitely going to. But I think we might be too jet lagged to have any drinks today. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely one we're going to do though. We ain't going to go home without doing that. We ain't going to go out doing that. No. So let's carry on. Just have a little quick walk down here. And as we've said so many times, memories just flooding back. Not from February. <laughs> from February. No, from like, from all these years that we've walked down here. We used to walk down here when this path was being built. We did. Didn't we? Yeah. yeah. That's how old we are. <laughs> so we made it here. Really, we just want a really big drink, that's what I want. And it, last time we came here, this was empty, but now it looks actually quite busy. So I don't know if I'll be able to vlog it in here or not. We will see. Coke. In Carol's Ace, to get the drinks, she decided to open them up to have a look what was inside. As if it was going to be a surprise what was inside. A... I was trying to see what was on his diet coke, what was all the Okay, way. and what happened? It, the lid came off. The lid came off and it went everywhere. Everywhere, look. <laughs> hey. But the question is, was it the diet coke or was it the regular? Yeah. Well, I'm having my one now, <laughs> anyway. So now Carol's become the cleaner. So what did you get, girl? Um, chicken, chicken bacon burger. Chicken bacon burger. Mm -hmm. yeah. Which is that one there? What's it look like? Oh, Let's sorry, have a quick look. Yeah. Yeah. Quite nice. The fries in here are the best in the world, ain't they? Well, I like they them. are really, really nice. I and I just went for just a normal standard burger because I'm not really that hungry and we shall carry on but the fries are the best them fries are definitely the best fries aren't they? I think so yeah <clears throat> definitely think so yeah just a shame I should have threw me <laughs> coke just a shame yeah just a shame that Carol decided for half a coke on the floor it's a sort of tradition like she does. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely one of our favourite burger places on International Drive, isn't it? It's my It's favorite. really good, yeah. Don't be like us and throw your Coke over the um, table. Try to drink it, it's much better that way. 
but they did actually give us a free refill, didn't they? They did. So we didn't pay nothing like that. Well. Yeah. So where are we off to now? We're going to Murphy's Bar. That's where we meet. Murphy's Bar, yeah. yeah. The Irish Bar. Yeah, I'll the take Irish it to Murphy's Bar. Meet yeah. up with the family. Okay then. So we're going now. Don't know if we'll be able to vlog it because of music, but let's carry on. We woke up this morning at four o'clock. And it is now in England time. It's got to be one o'clock, isn't it? What's the time here? Time is eight, nine, ten. Yeah, one o'clock. One o'clock. So we we are flagging quite a lot here, aren't we, Cal? We are. We are we really, really flagging. It's like we are the Walking Dead, <laughs> <laughs> ain't we? We look like it and we feel like it. <laughs> but now we're going to Murphy's Bar to have a drink. That a total, it totally take us over the edge. <laughs> Might put a spring in our step. Yeah, onward we go. So Murphy's Bar is down the side of the Gator Gulf, which is opposite, almost opposite the Avanti Hotel, I believe. We've never actually been in here before. And I don't, straight away, I met by copyright music, so I will probably won't be vlogging it in here. But, be nice for us just to go in and have a drink. Look, Carol, look, sees the drinks just straight in. Off you go. And there we go. I don't think they're in here. Should we just get a drink and sit down, yeah? Boy, oh, it's big here, isn't it? Hi. Very big. Okay, I'm just. What do you want? Just a beer, really. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna see if I can see him in here, yeah? So, Murphy's was quite a nice little bar, wasn't it? Yeah, we sat outside, then. didn't we? Yeah. It was too hot. Yeah, like a little pub. Mm. Really? Yeah, very, very nice. Well, that's the end of our travel day. We've got lots more vlogs coming on, haven't we? We have, yeah. yeah. We ain't sure what we're doing yet. We know we're doing SeaWorld, we know we're doing the Star Flyer, unfortunately. Yeah? Yeah. Um, we're doing bush gardens, probably clear water, maybe universal, not universal, no, maybe um, Epcot, yeah. And a lot of restaurants along International Drive and around the area. So anyway, thank you very much for watching. Thanks if you're subscribed. And to the next one, bye-bye. Good night. <laughs> Good night. Let's go back to the hotel now. Bye-bye. <laughs>